I have a reputation for being rather long-winded on this subject, and I admit to that. Because as Ray said, I have concluded a long time ago, frankly, that this is indeed, without the shadow of a doubt, the most important issue of our time, and I will hopefully try to explain that to you before the afternoon is over as to why I feel that way. Before I get into that part of it, I want to share a couple of comments with you here. I want you to understand some four words that I have lived with for the last 40 years. And you're all familiar with these words because you've all experienced them yourself. The first one is frustration. The second one is aggravation. The third one is anger. And the fourth one is outrage. And let me explain to you why those words are important to me before I get into the meat of my presentation. I am frustrated after 40 years of searching for the truth and 40 years of being laughed at and ridiculed by people who weren't curious enough to really seek the answers for themselves. I am aggravated at so-called scientists and experts who smugly and arrogantly snickered at ideas beyond their own vision and imagination and refused to see even that there would be a 21st, 22nd, and 23rd century science. I am angry at a national security system in this country that spends billions of your tax dollars covering up from you the greatest secret of our time. And I am outraged at a government who apparently believes that you can lie to all of the people all of the time. And the fact that you're here is encouraging to me because that proves that there are some of us that we will not allow them to lie to us all of the time. Now that I've vented my spleen on those four words, I feel a little better. Thank you.